Hey, what's up everyone? In today's video, I'm going to be going over a mall druid that could take down Uber Tristram. It's a little unorthodox of a build, but I wanted to test it out since it's not common and see if I was even able to do it. This is my first attempt with the mall druid and Ubers, so I will continue to evolve the build and make it a little bit better. Before we begin, if you could please give this video a like and subscribe to help me grow, I would greatly appreciate it. So I've always liked the Werebear ever since I started playing Diablo, however he was just never viable enough as a killer. He's kind of slow and for being a Werebear his tanking ability was just lacking up until recently. They've made quite a bit of progress since then even though it's still not perfect, but that's not stopping me from trying to make a build that could take down the Ubers. So for my stats, for strength, I just put in enough strength to wear my gear. That's all you really need. For dexterity, I would love max blocking. However, I'm wearing a phoenix shield and the amount of dex you would need is just outrageous. So I put in a little bit just to get at least 50% blocking. I believe some is better than none. Here I got 59% blocking. And then the rest of my points I put into vitality just to give me as much life as I possibly could get. So for my skills for the elemental tree I put at least one point into cyclone armor that just gives you a little bit of elemental absorb. For my shape shifting skills I max out lycanthropy that gives you you know more life more duration as your shape form. I max out werebear and I max out maul which is your main attack and then I put at least one point into shockwave you can max it out if you want to. I just use it just to stun some trash mobs just nothing crazy that's all I really use it for. And then for my summon skills, my summons get absolutely destroyed in the Ubers. I maxed out Oak Sage and he just doesn't last very long. It's just whatever you prefer. I want to try it to where I max out, you know, Grizzly and at least put some into its synergies. But I haven't tested that yet. I, I want to to see if my Grizzly will last a little bit longer. But that's pretty much it for skills. Since I'm using the Metamorphosis helmet, you know, you have Werewolves that you shift into. You get that one to trigger and then you switch to wear and get the trigger i'll go over that in a second but these are pretty much my skills nothing too crazy to it so for my gear i tried out a couple different setups this one i was able to do the ubers with so i'm just going to go over that for now for my weapon i wear grief you know it has prevent monster heal deadly strike ignores target defense i wear a fortitude armor before I put Fortitude on, I go and when I do my battle orders and all that stuff, I put on Treachery and I go and get hit to trigger Fade. That gives you a little bit more resistance. And then I go back and I put Fortitude on. And then for my shield, I love Phoenix Shield. It gives you damage. It has a little bit of fire absorb and fire resistance. And it get, this gives you a little bit of lightning resistance to help against Mephisto. So that's always nice. And the redemption is nice when you have to heal and kill some trash mobs. They'll heal you. So that's pretty good. And for my amulet and rings, I tried wearing a High Lords with the lightning resistance and deadly strike and... I was just lacking. My maul did not have enough attack rating. So I put on Angelic's amulet and then Angelic's ring for the attack rating bonus. And that seemed to be the missing key that I needed here to take it on. So my second attempt that I tried the Ubers with, I was able to take down everybody. I was stuck trying to kill Bale and I almost had him down. And then for some reason, my prevent monster heal wasn't kicking in. I think it's because I had last wish on. I have that on my mercenary now, but I had Last Wish on and it just wasn't working. The Prevent Monster Heal wasn't working. So I put this on and the attack rating really, really was my key factor for beating them. And then I have a Wisp on for when I go against Mephisto right off the bat. For my boots, I'm wearing Gore Riders. They give you Deadly Strike, Crushing Blow, and Open Wounds. Those will all help you against the Ubers. And then I'm wearing Drax. They give you Open Wounds, Life Leech if you need it, and the Life Tap really helps out if you're struggling with taking hits. I love Life Tap, so it really helps me out. And then I'm wearing Vertigos. It gives you some physical damage reduction, some life, and a little bit of faster hit recovery. Not too much, but just a little bit. And then for my helmet, of course, I'm wearing the new rune word, Metamorphosis. You go into Werewolf, and you get that triggered. And then you shift into Werebear, get that triggered. And then I go and I do my battle orders and summons and do all that. And then I get ready to go down into the portal. So now for my charms, I'm wearing the Bone Break Sunder for the physical damage. And then I'm wearing some shape-shifting Grand Charms. I put them down to 30 life just to show that you don't need max to do this. For Hellfire, 
I'm wearing, I have a perfect torch and then a perfect ante. It just depends on what you can get. Try to get the most resistances that you can get. That's really key in this moment. And then for charms, I know these show, some of them show 20 life, 5 resistances. But try to get, make sure your resistances are good and then add a little bit of life where you need it. And that's pretty much my gear setup that I go against with the Ubers. So for mercenaries, these guys are pretty hard to keep alive in Uber Tristram. However, this guy stayed with me almost to the very end. He died at the end there. But I have an Act 5 mercenary and I put a Last Wish on him. It gives you my aura, gives you a little bit more damage. And then his other weapon, I have a Lawbringer. It gives you Sanctuary and Sanctuary knocks back the undead. So when you're fighting Mephisto, it just knocks back the skeletons off you. It's pretty neat. I like it. And then I have a Fortitude on him just for or, you know defense and just it's a good armor for mercenary and for his helmet i have the new rune word ground which gives you know lightning resistance and lightning absorb i just wanted to try it out because mephisto's right off the bat and you know i want to have my mercenary last as long as possible and he did fairly decent so this is the mercenary setup that i use however you could just use whatever you prefer so that's pretty much my Uber Mall Druid. I'm going to end this video with me doing an Uber Tristram run so you can see what I do and how I do. It takes a little bit because he's a slower killer, but I was able to do it. So it's just something, you know, a little unorthodox if you want to try out a Werebear Druid and just give it a go. If not, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you could please give this video a like and subscribe to help me grow, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you. I didn't think.